Hi, I'm Michael from ShareMaster, and today I'm going to demonstrate how to change text and links in a SharePoint site pages using ShareMaster. You can use this same method to update files in a document library, whether they are Excel files, Word files, or any number of different uh, formats that we support. In a future video, I'll show you how you can correct links in an Excel file, which may have been migrated so that the links to other Excel files have been broken. Okay, so replacing text files is also a part of ShareMaster's migration. During the transfer, you can select specific words or links to replace, and as it migrates across, it'll automatically update each file. All right, so I'll jump right into it. If you look at my screen, you can see the DevPros uh, SharePoint site. You can see that it actually mentions DevPoint, which was an old company of ours. So if we go to another point, there's DevPoint. And on the content page, you can see DevPoint. And we also have a, a link to the DevPoint web page. Okay, so here we are in ShareMaster. We're going to go to Replace Master. And we'll log into the site, which we want to update. Okay, so ShareMaster Replace Master has the ability to update not only files, but also metadata in lists. Uh, and also metadata in document libraries. So we could go and select a list here and update all the items replacing certain text. But for this demonstration, we're just going to update the site pages document library. So here you can see the options of what we want to replace. If we replace text in uh, custom formatters and settings, that will actually replace the text in the JSON custom formatting. So you may have some uh, text that mention your business or a, or a link in, in your custom formatting, which you, is used to create uh, custom forms for your uh, adding, adding items. Um, and you may also want to replace text in the list items themselves. So if you want to update the metadata, you'll select the replace text in column values. But for this case, we just want to replace the files themselves so we'll select replace text in files and now you get the choice of what files you want to replace uh, the site pages are all ASPX files so we just need this one selected but we don't need to turn them off so we'll go next now we choose what uh, text we want to replace and we can choose for it to be case sensitive or case insensitive so we'll choose dev point and we'll change it to dev pros we also want to change the link so we'll change devpoint.com.au we'll change that to devpros.com.au okay and now we'll execute so what this is going to do is going to iterate through every single site page uh, it's going to read the files and if there's any mention of any of the text that we have chosen it'll replace it and then it'll re-upload it so it's important to note that it actually will increment the version Okay, so we've done in 19 seconds, and we can go check out the results. So here you can see it says DevPoint. We refresh the page, and now it's been updated to DevPros. The link has been updated to the DevPros web page. And every mention of DevPros in every page, oh, sorry, every mention of DevPoint in every page has been updated to DevPros. Okay, so that's it. Uh, you can see how easy it is to replace text or links using ShareMaster's Replace Master. Now, ShareMaster is currently in beta testing mode, and we are interested in uh, implementing new features. So if you have a feature request, please head over to ShareMaster.io and get in contact with us. If we get enough interest for a feature, or if we think that the feature may add value to our product, we may just implement it. Okay, see you later for now.